Hello everybody, today I have this Come Inside a Sex. This specific engine is from the year 2014. This engine is having high crankcase pressure, which includes um, oil consumption. They gold related those two problems, oil consumption and, and high crankcase pressure. Um, the crankcase pressure goes all the way over here, with, this is the crankcase filter. If you want to know how to replace the crankcase filter, you can check the video in the description below or in this corner of the video right now. Um, the situation that happens is then over the time the crankcase filter gets filled with stuff, with oil and stuff like that. This is the crankcase filter over here and it gets like all clogged and then the high um, crankcase pressure from the engine because the engine is having issues is going to increase the pressure over here and it's going to damage other components it's going to damage turbo, it's going to damage gaskets and some other stuff so there is a solution for this it is not uh, the right solution because the solution to fix the high crankcase pressure is to fix the engine you have to uh, take the engine apart, replace the liners, replace the piston rings and do an overhaul that would be the solution to fix this issue but if you don't want to spend that much money and you don't care about uh, oil consumption you can add oil and that's not a big deal or if the oil consumption is not that heavy still you can do this i have this filter right here this is the part number it's the same part number as it is a crankcase filter it's a cummins crankcase filter which is Flickgar, science Flickgar is their uh, OEM filter for Cummins. This filter is a EPA approved bypass. This is a bypass filter, as you can see, there is no filter at all. There is just this little thing over here that has a filter. I think that's good enough to make it a filter. And you have this little bar, bypass bar. This is a filter that you can buy uh, any store, but some of stores don't even know what it is, so you have to take the part number, that's why I'm giving you the part number. But, the thing is, like, with this filter, you bypass the crankcase. This is the EPA approved bypass, so you will avoid the high crankcase pressure with this filter. This will solve the high crankcase pressure. And it's the exact same filter, as you can see sucks and size everything is the same thing the, the same uh, component but it doesn't have this thick amount of filtration over here this one doesn't have anything it just have this valve so this is uh the solution for the high crankcase pressure this will not fix the oil consumption but it will fix the crankcase pressure um in the meantime you want to get some money to fix your engine I am making this video because I know many people don't even know about this and uh, it's gonna help a lot of people because people is having so much issue with this crankcase filter because it's a thick crankcase filter then generates a lot of pressure and with this one you're gonna fix that problem and you're gonna save many different components of the engine since the high crankcase pressure is the main reason why turbos and main gaskets like from and rear gaskets of the engine go bad. Especially this area over here, the front cover goes bad because the high crankcase pressure. It's a very common problem coming inside sex. So I'm going to start this one and I'm going to fix this problem. So that's be all I'm going to show you since uh, nobody talks about this situation with the high crankcase pressure and, and coming inside sex is very common to have these problems, especially with this filter. So you have this problem just buy this filter part number over here again so you can see it this is a six the end is a six so uh that way you will fix uh your situation and you will be able to run your truck more time in order to get some money to repair it so if you have any questions about this video you can use the comment section below to leave any kind of questions comments opinions or anything to add about this video uh, so we can help different kind of people all over the world If you want to send some support to my channel, you can check 
the video description below where I have details how to send support to my channel so I can continue making helpful videos to everybody like this one I am doing right now. So, so like, share, subscribe and thank you for watching.